Hey up guys, Pokemark here, back with another video. And for a second I want you to all close your eyes and remember this time last year when Pokemon Company officially announced the tag team Pokemon, the first tag team cards that were going to come out in January 2019. So we had Snorlax and Eevee, we had Pikachu Zekrom, we had Gengar Mimikyu, we had all those amazing cards. We were yet to realise how much of an impact they were going to make on the meta game for the standard and for expanded to be fair. And just that one card that everybody went crazy for, Jirachi. Now Jirachi was a game changer in the game because for no cost at all whatsoever, apart from putting it to sleep, you got to search the top five cards of your deck and pick an item or a supporter or anything out of there and that helped a lot of decks out so because you could use it more than once and it was just nobody knew how much it changed the game no one knew how much value it would cause and it skyrocketed to up to, to about 30 pounds at one point <clears throat> and just, it's just crazy and then also they re released it quite recently in the Ultra Necrozma deck box that they got in the battle box and that slightly damaged the value of it but nonetheless still a great card a year later and obviously we're going to lose it next year in rotation but unfortunately that's the way it goes but we will still have it expanded because expanded from now on as far as I'm aware, are never going to rotate. They're going to keep the cards and just ban ones that are unbalanced. So the reason why I've put you on that bit of a nostalgia trip because I picked up a booster box of Team Up so that we can open it and see just exactly how many Jirachis we can get. The last box I got, I pulled three Jirachis and two Magikarp. Funny how Magikarp are actually more rare to get than the Jirachi, but one of them was reverse and one was a hollow, so yeah, either way, it was quite a, a nice little uh, pull there. I uh, can't remember what rainbow I got in there, but it wasn't Pika Rom. So let's get into this deck, this box. What I'm going to do is I'm going to split it into this video into two, so I'll do the first half of the box and then I'll put, upload the second half at another time just to make the video shorter, short enough that it's not going to take a year to load up because nobody likes that and I hate waiting because I can't use my iPad then. So let's crack into it. <clears throat> so I picked this box up quite cheap for English kind of sets. Uh, just because my local game shop is trying to clear his stock out ready to get the new stuff in, the Sun Shield, more Cosmic Eclipse stuff. He doesn't really get the collector's boxes, he just gets random things every so often. He did get the Hidden Fates Pokeball boxes from me, which are quite good I pre-ordered them. But he accidentally picked up Team Up and ended up with six boxes, so uh, he was selling them off cheap to try and get rid of them. And I think I paid about £80, so I'm quite happy with that. So, let's get into the first pack. The gold card, to me, I believe will be the Rainbow Picaron, because I've not pulled that yet, quite frankly, and um, I really want to. Still got quite a decent value into it, so uh, let's see what we do. So we have Water Energy, Dublade, Flaffy, Morgan, Cosmog, Litten, Grimer, Execute, Lavatar, Reverse, Ingo and Emmet, and ha, straight off the bat, first pack, and we get Pikachu Zekrom. So uh, that's roughly about £10 at the moment now, so that's an eighth of the box so far that I've pulled for it, so really happy with that pull. And um, I've got some sleeves with me today, so uh, we can sleeve these up straight away because uh, you know how people don't like valuable cards getting damaged. So there we go, that's one down. So 
So if you're new to the channel, do like and subscribe so you can keep up to date with the latest videos I have. And I'll be doing more. So I will by this time this video goes up, I will have uploaded a video in regards to the uh, Star Wars game that came out recently on the Xbox and the PS4. I picked up on PS4 and I did a video unboxing the whole, the exclusive game version where you did get uh, quite a lot of things. So check that video out and uh, leave a like on it. So the rare is Lapras. <clears throat> Still struggling with this cold. Can't seem to get rid of it. I never, never do seem to get rid of uh, colds very quickly, unfortunately. Just so happens with life. <coughs> Kabuto. Nita. Nidorina. Meowth. Geodude. Grimer. Pidgey. Ooh. Bronzar. Nidorino. And the rare. <laughs> Another one. So three in and with, we've got two GXs. Really happy with that. So that's Gengar Mimikyu. Another one that I've got. So that'll probably go into my trade folder. I know a few people wanted to play it. Um, it's not bad, it's annoying to play against, but each to their own, I guess. <clears throat> Let's see what we have here. Return label, Kangaskhan, Cosmome, Bronzar, Dratini, Tentacool, Ponyta, Grimer, Reverse Kakuna, and we've got a, a Hollow Absol. So not bad so far. Funny thing with this set, when it first came out, and we saw the Hat Ladies, the Chalet Girls, uh, I decided to make a Rayquaza deck with them in it, and had mixed results uh, to the point where I give up on it eventually because. <coughs> it just wasn't very re reliable having to get four cards in hand to build this card to find a maximum of 12 energies wasn't very viable and standard or expanded to be fair and hey so we've got a, our first secret rare the Pokemon communication really happy with that one that's my second one I've pulled from this set so uh, not going to complain that's going towards my play set Really good box so far. I'm really impressed with it. Apart from the fact the packets won't open very well. Just because it help, doesn't help when you've uh, got your iPad in front of you. Oh, come on. Graceful like a fox. Right. The grass energy, grass memory, Kakuna, Rapidash, Fullerby, Weedle, Liptile, <clears throat> Execute, Ferroseed, Reforces, Full Picks, and the rare Mighty Air. A very, very off cut Mighty Air. If you look at that. Wow. Back when Pokemon didn't care about the quality of the cards. Didn't really do much to change it to be fair as, as the sun and moon went on. But hopefully with Sword and Shield they'll correct that and they'll end up making the cards a lot more consistent around the edges. Because I can imagine them having the V cards be worth quite a lot of money to be fair. Because we've finally now got the full versions of Zamzenta and Zacian in card form. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I haven't yet bought or opened the packs from the starter Pokemon. I don't think I will bother now because the, the Jumbo V cards are complete and there's no point now we know for a fact what we've got in, in them. No point buying them. I'll just buy the promos later on. <clears throat> uh, we've got Persian. Metal Goggles, Golduck, Squirtle, Klefki, Voltorb, Wheel, 
Volby, the Reverse is Cosmog, and the Rare is Muck. <coughs> yeah, sorry about that, guys. Probably should have waited until I'm not dying of man flu before opening these because all you're going to hear is me coughing and no one wants to hear that. Feel free to mute the video. So we have Energy, Ammonite, Water Memory, Kangaskhan, Cosmog, Magikarp, Zoroa, Lavitar, Psyduck, Reverse Pokemon Communication, and Garbantula. <coughs> nice to know that Jakeman's uh, cough sweets work a treat. Seems like I can definitely notice my cough is not getting worse. Farfetched. Clefki, Voltorb, Weedle, Fullaby, Dratini, Reverse Blitzel, and Seb Striker. Wow, rip for PSA 10s in this blood boost box with the, the off cuts. Memory, Kakuna, Rapidash, Hone Edge, Pidgeotto, first one we've seen today, Nidoran, Cosmog, Magikarp, Reverse Nita, and an Aerodactyl. Wow, that's even worse. I've got Pokemon, what are you doing? Wow. Imagine pulling the money card out of a set for it to be so miscut. Imagine getting a Reshes card, Rainbow Rare, and it being badly miscut like this. Even the energy cards are really bad. Look at that. Wow. They need to sort that out for Sun and Moon. They really need to do it. So the, well, the follow into Sun and Shield with that. Joltic, Blitzel. Squirtle, Tentacool, Omanite, and uh, Mr. Mime. <clears throat> so don't forget to hit that like button and share and support the channel because it, we I am looking into new cameras at the moment. And with Black Friday sales being on, I might just be able to get hold of them. I will be also possibly getting a new iPad so I can actually do some editing on the video. So then you can not hear me coughing through this video. Uh, reverse Farfetch'd and Nine Tails. Very playable card at the moment, especially with, well, with Fire decks. Possibly with Reshi Robin decks that have come out, where they use fire, just discard it and you can switch them over. It's better than using a custom catcher because you don't have to find them, they're in there. You can use Giant Hearth to get your fire energy. And yeah, I've used that recently with this uh, with the deck that I've built. I built a deck with Reshi uh, Re and it had one Reshi in it, and it's so turbo, it's really fun to play. I went to a challenge on Monday and went to two wins, two losses because it, it did kind of brick for two of the games. It were a best of one, um, but it was a fun. I'm going to keep with the deck. I'm going to try and practice with it more and hopefully get it. It uses three did dead day, which is a really quite big, and especially when you start with it, it's just a nightmare. So. Pulls have slowed down a bit in this box so far in the first half, but hopefully it will change. So we get some good pulls, but hopefully not too much that you don't come back to the next video and see nothing get pulled. Because uh, that would just be awkward, to be fair. But I've never had a box where the box has been one-sided. You always get something in both sides. Charmander, Reverse Persian and an Electrode. Oh. 
In pre-release, when this came out, I pulled so many of this card, I got bored of seeing it, and it's just a ball of fluff, and nobody likes it. Go away. <clears throat> You'd rather have seen a GX, or a full art supporter. Not seen a Jirachi yet. That's uh, worrying, because they're not guaranteed in the box, but... You'd think at least one would have shown up by now. So, Ingo and Emmett, Quartartle, Taurus, Charmander, Mankey, Litten, Emolga, Mary, Dangerous Drill, and the rare, a little Marowak. So, we have three more packs of this video, and then I'll open the rest on a different one for you. So do come back to the channel and see that second video where hopefully we'll pull more than just the secret rare and two GXs. I know consistency wasn't great with this set but come on, three pull, pull so far. It's not definitely not worth the money at the moment. <clears throat> now we've got Meowth, Nidoran, Mareep, Ferroseed, Charmander, Bronzar, and the rare, Starmie. Wow. Come on, box. Give me more than three pulls. Definitely not Cosmic Eclipse, is it, guys? Where you get a pull nearly every single pack. Freezing Forest. Again, they're getting even worse. Look at how thin that is. Come on, guys. Consistency. Tentacool, Grimer, Pidgey, Dratini, and we have our first Prism Star. Normally you get about four in a pack in a box, so we've still got three more. Obviously the main ones from this set is Tapu Koko and Shaman, both Prisms and the Brilliant, very playable. And Neo Queen. <clears throat> So, let's hope we get last pack magic, and my voice holds out until the end of it. <clears throat> so we've got Fairy, Tauricat, Broxgrit, Communication, Puccina, Nidoran, Pancham, Voltorb, Klefki, Reverses Mimikyu and Primeape. So, that wasn't a great half of the box and can't really blame it. So we've got Wondrous Labyrinth, Electrode, Reverse Pokemon Communication, Aegislash, then we've got the Pokemon Communication, Absol, Gengar Mimikyu and Picaram. So, not bad for the first half. Hopefully the second half will have more. So do stay tuned and when the next video pops up, you'll be able to see the remainder of the, the box. So for now, that is the first half and I will see you again. My name is Pokemark and good night.